The World Waterworks Demon Animox Treatment System is a high-strength ammonia process ideally suited for anaerobically digested or industrial process flows. Operating in either continuous or sequencing batch reactor modes, the Demon Animox process offers a low-cost alternative to manage high-strength ammonia return streams, thus significantly lowering the load on the mainstream biological process. With the specially designed pH control system, the Demon Animox process provides the lowest cost total nitrogen removal with simple and flexible operation and no supplemental alkalinity or carbon requirements. Shown here in continuous mode, Demon is a 100% flow through process, meaning the flow rate of the reactor effluent is the same as the influent. While in this mode, the water will enter the reactor and go through a two-phase cycle. In the first phase, known as the aeration phase, dissolved air will enter into the reactor through the ultra-fine bubble flat panels mounted on the reactor floor. This aeration system will also provide the mixing to keep the bacteria suspended throughout the reactor. Ammonia oxidizing bacteria, or AOBs, will convert 50% of the ammonia into nitrite, leaving some ammonia still in the water. Oxygen will serve as the fuel source to keep the AOBs thriving. Due to the AOBs converting the ammonia and the continuous flow of the system, the alkalinity, or pH, will begin to drop. The pH control program will monitor the pH as well as the dissolved oxygen inside the reactor. Once the pH level reaches the low set point, the blowers will shut off and the reactor will enter into the second phase, known as the mixing phase. It is during this anoxic phase that the Animox will go to work at their maximum potential under zero dissolved oxygen conditions. Inside the reactor, a mixer will turn on to keep all of the contents mixed well. The Animox will use the newly formed nitrite as well as the remaining ammonia in a specific ratio and convert to nitrogen gas. Due to the Animox using the ammonia and nitrite as its fuel sources, there is no need for additional external carbon sources. While still being fed during the mixing phase, once the pH reaches the high set point, the blowers will turn back on and the cycle will start over again. The Animox granular bacteria are a slow-growing bacteria. Due to this, care must be taken to keep them inside the reactor. This is accomplished in two ways. First, when wasting is required by the process, the reactor contents are pumped to a microscreen, which will separate the Animox granules from the other bulk suspended growth bacteria. The larger Animox granules will go back into the reactor, while the waste bacteria will be sent to solids processing. In addition to the microscreen is an internal settling zone, which allows the heavier sludge to settle and be reintroduced back into the reactor via gravity, and the cleaner effluent to leave the reactor and be sent back to the front of the plant. Traditionally, high ammonia levels coming from the recycle stream would require increased aeration requirements additional external carbon, and possibly alkalinity to try to deal with the problem. The World Waterworks Demon Animox process helps to decrease this problem by providing the lowest cost total nitrogen removal process. By using the Demon Animox process, municipalities can have greater than 60% less energy consumption, as well as 90% less sludge production with no supplemental alkalinity or external carbon required. Plants will have simple and flexible operation, quick startup utilizing seed sludge, and the ability to easily retrofit the process to existing tanks, all while maintaining zero carbon footprint. We at World Waterworks are ensuring our wastewater treatment systems meet today's challenges while preparing for tomorrow's needs.